Hey guys, it's me, Delicious Delights. Welcome to my channel. Today I want to talk about the newest release from the House of Chloe, or Chloe. I have no idea how to say it, uh, but this is called Chloe Low Eau de Toilette. Uh, release 2019. I know it's not really showing it well, sorry. Uh, that's what the bottle looks like. Really, really cute. Uh, pink pastel. Really adorable. Okay. So, these are my first impressions. I have worn it on my skin and I have it on the paper here. Alright. So, the opening of this perfume is a fruity, fresh, citrus opening. So more specifically, to me, it smells like a pink grapefruit cream, if there was such a thing. Um, tart, uh, sweet. It's like if you were to take this creamy pink grapefruit smell and like put it on top of some a bouquet of white florals. It's a really, really, really gorgeous opening. Uh, it quite surprised me, to be honest. I wasn't expecting something so, so gorgeous. <laughs> um, yeah, really, really nice. Uh, the, the notes in here, in the top, there's rose, grapefruit, and lychee. Uh, in the mid, there's magnolia and rose again, so two times rose. And in the base, there's oak moss, cedar, amber, and musk. Ooh, the opening is going to... Going to I think impress a lot of people because I think it just smells really, really, really pleasant. So after that beautiful opening, hmm, in the middle of this fragrance, you get a very super soft and sweet and elegant smell. I do get the lychee smell in here. I love lychees. I've been eating them since... I was a kid, whenever my mom can get them cheap, when they were on discount at the Asian store, Asian grocery store, uh, she would come home with like a big bag of them and she also bought them canned and I just loved it every single time they were on discount so I could eat them. So when I do smell this, I do get that really beautiful fruity lychee smell which really does bring me back to my childhood and I think it smells really nice. Um, Along with that, it's a bit powdery. It gets a little bit more powdery in the mid on my skin. I don't really get rose in here. I do get florals, yes. More so like white florals, but I don't get rose for some reason. I'm not really picking up on that. Um, in the mid, the florals in here do overtake that creamy grapefruit slash, slash lychee smell. And then the florals feel really thick and dense. Oh, it's... <laughs> so I love the opening. I love the mid. Uh, the dry down of this fragrance, I also love a lot too. Um, it just feels like the florals get more richer and more fuller and more denser and more thicker. I still get that really fruity, creamy, lychee grapefruit as well. But that, that scent kind of uh, like falls behind and it's more about the florals in the dry down and in the dry down in my skin I get also on my on me some spice like a very very faint spice and I don't see any spice in the notes but on my skin I do get it like I don't know what kind of spice it's like a warm maybe like a clovey thing and I, I'm not sure if any of you guys smell that as well but I really really enjoy that too because it just add some, you know, like a punch to this fragrance at the very, very end, <laughs> kind of like a grand finale. And um, mm, really, really, really nice, you guys. I'm just kind of really, really impressed with this fragrance. Uh, it's that spicy, rich, buttery floral scent with a light dusting of sweet powder on top. And yeah, this is definitely uh, one of the better ones that I've tried this entire year. Um, everything, the opening, mid, and dry down, everything uh, lovely smells on me. Um, as I said before, I really love that grapefruit lychee thing. I 
love how creamy it is. It stays fresh throughout the whole entire fragrance. It never feels cloying or overbearing or annoying. It just smells really pretty, really innocent. And I'm kind of thinking that if I were to wear like a pink pastel dress of some sort, this is what I would want to wear with it because it has that kind of feeling like really light and pretty and princessy almost, um, which is not really pers of my, uh, part of my personality, but sometimes I like to be super girly, believe it or not. Okay, <laughs> so yeah, that was my review, guys, of Chloe Lowe Eau de Toilette. It's not showing. Ah, there you go. There you go. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this review. If you guys have tried this, I'd love to hear your opinion on it. Uh, oh gosh, I think that a lot of people will like this perfume. And I'm really happy that I got a chance to try this out. I'm really, really, um, I'm really, I won't say excited, but I really just enjoyed experiencing this one on my skin. Anyways, that was my review. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll be back with more soon. And take care. See ya. Bye-bye.